Well, hello everybody. Welcome back with me. You know me, I'm Kevin. And today, we're gonna answer which one is better, the, the EV3 or the NXT. So, just to start with everything, well, you might think that the EV3 is better, it's newer, and you might... <clears throat> the thing which is obvious, it has four motor ports like that. But seriously, which one? So, to start with everything, let's just get with the whole set. So first, well, of course, you know that the NXT, it is <clears throat> the color, oops, the color sensor is itself, and there's another light sensor. While in the EV3, there's only one of them, which is the color sensor itself, together with the light sensor. So basically, this thing is this thing and, and the color sensor and the light sensor combined and you get this and then well in here we have the gyro sensor which you <clears throat> obviously this thing is the thing that you get in the EV3 set and we have the medium motor which the NXT doesn't have well mostly th these things can be used for like s just small parts in the machine like some kind of finger or grabber or something like that but well of course the EV3 have something that the NXT doesn't have but also the NXT have the sound sensor which the EV3 doesn't have and and as you can see in the program <clears throat> in one of the sensors it says NXT sound sensor So now we've talked about the whole set. Now let's get to each things individually, excluding the ones that has, which are the only ones of its sets, and the things that we've already talked about. Well, let's just keep this. Now, the intelligent brake. the The only thing you will, <clears throat> you'll probably, oh, not probably, always need this when you're gonna make anything. A robot is simple arm or anything like that now first just from the physical differences you can see here that the <coughs> that the peg holes are different like this obviously and also on the other side it has a USB and an SD port well again in the batteries this one is smaller and then now let's see the inside turn it on Yeah, the NXT is obviously turning on faster than the EV3. I mean like, I could have already accessed everything in here. Like this one. Yeah, I've already be, be able to access everything in just like an instant. While this one is still starting. Now, it, it has already <clears throat> turn on. I've already turned this thing off because well, it's done with this. And you can obviously see that the interface of the NXT in there is different, obviously, with this one. It has also six buttons, including the back button. And, well, in here, you can, there's actually also IR control where you actually have to, <clears throat> where you can actually get the IR infrared sensor with the controller itself it's in another set but well I don't have it and to shut it down you can see that the NXT shutdowns in like instantly well yeah actually instantly just when you press ok like that shut down but when you turn it off yeah just another long wait So now, the whole set done, the intelligent break done, now let's get to the motors. From its physical <clears throat> difference, well, you can obviously see that, well, you know, that the motor wheel is actually 
it's kind of like, like pushed down a bit while this one is pulled up a bit well you can just kind of like put your finger here and like this compare it with this and in the back well the ports are the same so basically if you lose <clears throat> all somehow you lose all your NXT wires you still have your EVG wires and in the back here you can see that the <clears throat> EVG has a top beam here while well, not the NXT and <clears throat> in here well this thing is kind of a block blocky like this like squares lines like that while well, this one is just nice and simple round and also for, <clears throat> for this one actually the EV3 motor is actually faster and stronger than the NXT motor also in the holes here you can you can obviously see that this is an ax axle only hole instead of the peg holes Now, let's get to the ultrasonic sensors. Well, if you are actually already have these both, well, you will definitely know that, well, the distance limit of these both are just the same. Well, 250 centimeters, because, well, you know, <clears throat> well, I barely use inches like that. And if you see in this back, the, mo <clears throat> the, the wire ports here, I just kind of like turned around but still you can use the NXT or EVG wires for these both and you and if you already have the set you'll notice already that the EVG has these back holes but not the NXT and also well what I notice that the EVG ultrasonic sensor is bigger than this So now, we have the last one, the touch sensor. Actually, these things are almost like the exact same. Just their shape, their color, and the holes here. And of course, the back, they're kind of like, like turned around. Actually, this, this actually applies for, to everything though. The sensors we have in here, you can pretty much see they're all turned around turned around also we have the gyro sensor they're all turned around so well now then we already compared everything well even though I've already compared everything, think about everything, I still cannot say which one really is better. Well, <clears throat> you might say that the EV3 is more better. It has four motor ports. But well, actually not necessarily though. Because well, <clears throat> you know that the EV3 programmer can program the NXT, but also the opposite. Actually, in the programming <clears throat> software, the kind of like the block edit where I have blocks to command the NXT what to do it's actually more simpler than the EV3 well for this one they only have three ports so if you want to make everything just nice and simple use this but if you want to have something more complex like for example the robotic arm that I made last time use this because well even though it's already four you can only control four fingers and they are only open and close and well of course you can <clears throat> well the fun thing is you can use the NXT motor on the EV3 while programming this thing as the EV3 motor so now well let's just end this video thank you so much for watching <clears throat> well don't forget to like and subscribe and just comment down below which one you think is better, the EVG or the NXT. It's your decision.